supports the fight against breast cancer and we've launched a project to help raise awareness. The initiative takes the form of local celebrities dressed in their favourite saris and we're about to give you a behind the scenes glimpse of the photo shoot. An iconic Durban hotel hosted the shoot. The average woman goes from being a daughter to a wife or partner to a mother. We become the givers of life. But ever so often we forget about this person. Sometimes we need to take time off to love and care for ourselves. Breast cancer is something that affects thousands of women just like you and me at any time of our lives. And it's made us realize that we need to stop and look within. Today we think pink and present to you the Mela Breast Cancer Awareness photo shoot with 11 inspiring women. Each of the 11 ladies gave her immediate and enthusiastic support, inspired by their personal experience of cancer or because members of their family and circle of friends had been affected by the disease. This wasn't incidental philanthropy, but a cause in which they were individually invested. Being a medical doctor, such a campaign, uh, especially with breast cancer, is something that I diagnose. I've been touched by directly and indirectly in my own life. This project is very close to my heart. I come across patients and I come across people in the Miss India South Africa team that have dealt with uh, cancer in any form. We as women are extremely strong in how we deal with situations and being there to create awareness around this uh, is extremely important. We've got to support each other and be there for each other. Each of the Mela models had a look to match the theme of elegant glamour. Accessories were selected to complement the outfit, while hairstyles and makeup were expertly applied to show off the ladies' classic looks to maximum advantage. This was also a labour of love for the behind-the-scenes team. Barista, why did you decide to join this project? I joined because uh, breast cancer is something that affects a lot of women around the world and it doesn't matter what colour you are and me being a woman myself, I wanted to be involved with it. Now, the theme that we're going for is a 50s, 60s Bollywood or Hollywood sirens. How did you interpret the theme? What inspired me was Rekha. She's a famous Bollywood actress. The fact that they're using saris, which is very Bollywood, she loves her winged liner and her false lashes. So for me, that was a big bonus in terms of achieving this look. And with the bronzing as well as the lip color, it just matched and achieved the whole look overall. I do know of many women, family, friends, clients that have been uh, survivors of breast cancer and I'm very much for empowering women and making them feel stronger. We must remember one thing, that it not only affects us as a person, it affects our families, who we are and our whole environment. Flight attendant Roshni Jagti had no warning that breast cancer was about to strike. Roshni, how did you find out that you uh, were diagnosed with uh, breast cancer. I was on holiday overseas, I was on a cruise and we'd just gone out kayaking and got back in and whilst in the shower I felt a lump. I went immediately to see my gynae. My doctor then insisted I go for a biopsy. He then said to me, you've got aggressive lobular carcinoma. I was, what is that? <laughs> You're least expecting this. You don't know what this is. And he says, I said, what are you talking? And he says, Okay, it's breast cancer. I think those were the last words you don't ever want to hear from anybody. You just go through this whole emotional breakdown. It's like, why me? You think you've done something wrong, you've not eaten properly enough, exercised, or you are not taken care of yourself. It was like a death sentence. Both my, my whole family was shaken with it. The whole weekend that we went through, but to be honest, it felt like a funeral house because everyone was just crying. Going forward, how did you change your life and what did you change about it? That scared me the most was, I'm talking to these medical professional people that are talking to me and I didn't understand what they were telling me. I was just crying because they are using terminology that I don't know what it is. I think that whole week we didn't sleep. We armed ourselves, we were just sitting and reading and reading and researching. That by the second week when I got down to taking the treatment, I knew exactly where and what they were talking about. Going forward, how did you change your life and what did you change about it? Your diet changes, your lifestyle, meaning you're more aware and you're more health conscientious, you more you want to live properly, eat properly. Uh, you mentioned you have become a motivational speaker. Tell us more about that. The fact that I survived this and I'm here to still stand and tell you I've done it. I realized I needed to talk to people out there because I was lying in the same bed. I went through all the emotions that they are experiencing, but you know what, there is hope. 
The aim of the photo shoot was to create a portfolio of striking images to be used as part of Mela's breast cancer awareness campaign. Saris formed a stylistic theme and photographer Valen Peters fired up his flash guns and his creativity to capture the combined elegance of model, costume and location. Valen, why did you decide to be part of this initiative? Well, I thought it was an exciting initiative that would help bring awareness about cancer and reach more people and make them understand or help them understand the effects that cancer can have. I think it's a great initiative. I mean, a bunch of successful women getting together and saying, hey, we're here, we're supporting you and uh, just showing support in such a symbolic and metaphoric, beautiful way. This is a, something that's close to all of our hearts. So we have lots of people in the family that are either survivors or that we have lost to cancer. And why did you choose this beautiful sari today? The sari is very close to my heart. It's actually a vintage sari. It's my mum's. And I had to get her to dig into her treasure trove in her kist, and she came up with this. I have been touched by uh, a family member, you know, passing away because of cancer, and I'm really happy to be here and to contribute and to be a part of this. My calling is to work with people that are vulnerable, people that life circumstances are in discomfort or trauma. The awareness today with regards to breast cancer falls right into that category. I had such an awesome day with such dynamic ladies. All of them are just so inspirational as well as uh, motivated and just dynamic. We had such fun as females just empowering and embracing each other and our womanhood. I must say you look absolutely stunning in a sari. Is this your first time? My very first time. And I loved it. It's a lot of work. I must I say, I've been taught that you need to kick while you walk. I feel like I am a Bollywood star. All the ladies showed star quality, but the focus was on cancer awareness. For women who self-examine, how do you know whether it is a lump to be worried about or, or could it just be fatty tissue? You need to look for uh, signs on the skin. So if you've got new itchiness, new eczema, if there's a discharge coming out of the nipple, if the nipple retracts or moves back into the breast, and then obviously that lump you find something that you're not comfortable with, immediately seek medical advice. The event also offered an opportunity for ideas to be exchanged and thoughts shared. Cancer has no regard for gender, age or social standing, and the fight against it is a collective struggle. It's hoped that this project will not only promote awareness and thus early detection, but also be a springboard for further initiatives. Spending the day with 11 beautiful, courageous women was nothing short of inspirational. Listening to them share their stories and experiences made me realize that phenomenal things can happen when women come together. Our awareness campaign for breast cancer doesn't end here, it's ongoing. And remember, we only know how strong we are until strong is the only choice we have. Mela is committed to raising breast cancer awareness. With the incidence of breast cancer on the rise, knowledge is your first defense. On our Facebook page, Dr. Sheena Ganesh will cover frequently asked questions, as well as more specific issues that you may raise. But remember that no diagnosis can be offered online. We're also inviting you to share your survival stories. And above all, find out everything you can about breast cancer, because early detection is your best protection.